For the past weeks, students at the Academy of Engineering at H. Grady Spruce High School have been working on cubes. They have drawn them, built them, measured them, and manipulated them through computer programs. The whole time, they have been learning complex mathematics and engineering concepts, as well as acquiring critical thinking skills that will help them excel throughout high school and in college. By the time they're done with each class, there's something else significant that they've learned that not only uses all the skills they're learning in their other classes that year, but it also gives them another separate skill that's a real life skill that's something they're going to do either in college, like studying, taking tests that are a lot more difficult because they're combining everything. It's not just I'm in a math class, I'm going to take a math test, or I'm in science, I need to know this. It's I'm going to use math science, so I'm going to use math and science to write this paragraph in English and it's got to be written pretty well. So they're using all their skills, so it makes, it, it brings everything together, plus they're learning other separate skills on the side that help them in both uh, college and career readiness. The Academy is not only outstanding because it is one of the first that the National Academy Foundation piloted in 2008, or because it is the first Academy of Engineering to open in Dallas ISD. It also is special because it allows students to find their hidden math skills and a passion for science. I want to do something that I don't normally do and in there it involves a lot of hands-on work which is what I like because I don't really like being still. I think it's actually helped me a lot in math because I wasn't that good and I've noticed my grades have been better this year than last year. For some of the 140 students in the program, the Academy of Engineering, one of 19 different academies set up by the National Academy Foundation in Dallas ISD, is a dream come true because they can explore the career of their choice while in high school. What made me choose Academy of Engineering is because I want to become an electrical engineer because it's green and it doesn't use any chemicals. What also makes the Academy of Engineering at Spruce special is that it has an almost 50-50 ratio of male and female students, a ratio that is unusual even for college engineering programs. The students in the program at Spruce think it's the perfect fit for any woman, regardless of the field they want to go into in college. Because they think it's more of a guy stuff since it involves a lot of tools and a lot of building and stuff and I don't think a lot of girls think that it, we can actually do it. I've been looking a lot into being a nurse. They don't believe that women can be engineering. Some of them don't want to get their hands dirty, don't want to do hands on. And mostly engineering is mainly like a male dominant. I would tell them that just go for engineering because you never know, like the things that you do, it might be hard but it will show you that you can, like you can do it if you just put your mind into it. They realize, oh, like this is actually something really cool and when they get past the point of thinking it's just engineering and since they're learning all these skills of combination of different academic categories as well as all the other life skills that they're actually learning, they can take all of that, combine it together, and do that, go into any field they want to go. They don't have to go into a math and science based field. They don't even have to go into engineering. But whatever they're going to do, they're going to walk out of each individual class as a better student, a better learner, and a better person.